Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's get into it. I'm Kenyatta, and this will be a reading called The Meeting. I will be using two decks, the Romance Angel Oracle cards, as well as the Hoodoo Tarot deck. I'd like to know either how they met or what their meeting was all about. The relationship between these two. Separation. Past life relationship. Traction. Release your ex. Okay, so I feel like I'm dealing here with a past life relationship. This man and woman knew each other in a past life. Obviously, there was an attraction here. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Okay. Separation here. Separation... Uh, from the past life to the present life? Was there a separation? Was there a separation in the past life? Was there a separation in the present life? There was an attraction. And release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. I feel like there had to be a release. And moving on. Let me keep those cards up. So I can... Refer back to them if necessary. <laughs> Voodoo Tarot deck, please speak to me about this meeting between this man and this woman who had a past life relationship. Tell me about this present life. All right, let's get into it. Here we have two of baskets in reverse. Eight of knives, upright. Big mama, upright. Four of knives in reverse. And daughter of knives, upright.
Okay, so, so far, I feel like um, what I'm seeing here speaks to the separation. These two could not be friends. They could not come together in love. They were not allowed, I'm hearing. This ended almost as soon as it started. Quickly. They were not allowed to be friends. Not allowed to be lovers. Not allowed. I'm hearing in a time separate from the time that you know now. I'm here, we are delving into the um, current lives of these individuals, okay? I feel like this caused um, some pain and suffering here. A lot of pain, a lot of suffering. Imprisoned, not able to uh, get to separation, okay? Not able to get to the one that they love, maybe possibly the one that they knew well, if this is a past life relationship connection here. It's whoever uh, had control over the allowing or not allowing felt that this was going to be um, a better situation for all involved. For them to stay apart. There was not any, even anything to consider. We won't consider it. It will not be considered. This needs to end. Um, you all need to separate. Let it go and move on. Son of Knives. Upright. Two of knives. Upright. Miss Ida in reverse. Four of baskets. Upright. I feel as though uh, this man here, the man involved, possibly was looked at as, <coughs> excuse me, possibly was looked at as a child, um, maybe who just was uh, just wanted possibly to have sex with this the woman. Whoever the woman is. By this person who was able to tell them, no, this is not going to. There can be no connection here, but I'm hearing reconnection. Okay, maybe the person who stopped it was part of this, their past life journey as well. I'm hearing they were. So these two could not come together. All he wants to do here is penetrate you, not be with you, not in, you know, enjoy you, love you, take care of you. I'm hearing the word momentous. This person here, this man possibly wanted to marry this woman. Engage. Maybe there was an engagement. Not allowed, I'm hearing. This will not be allowed. But I feel as though um, this the man involved here kind of, well, definitely did have a sexual interaction with the woman. But I feel as though his mind was more focused on love and marriage at home. The possibilities of uh, creating a place of bliss is what I'm hearing at home. Not just sex. I love you. I want to be with you. Adore you. Treat you right. The woman I feel may have been in a place of, I am hearing despair, but um, uncertain as to what she should do. 
if she should move forward with him. I move backwards, stay away. The mother I'm hearing involved, her mother. Moving him away from her. You cannot be with her. You cannot have her. She is mine. She is my child. She is my daughter. You will not be allowed to come near her, to share space with her. Stay away. She is mine. Not yours. She belongs to me. She is my child. And I'm hearing, not yours. Wonder if this man was much older than this woman here. I'm hearing a lot. A little enough. Old enough. She's not yours to take care of. To watch over. To represent. Hmm. We will represent her. She is ours. Okay, ours, maybe the mother now is talking about the woman's father as well. Once again, this was not anything that... Um, The mother here contemplated, thought about, prayed about okay, whatever I feel as though the man was offering to the woman, the mother refused. There is not enough here that you can offer to make me give you or to give up my child to you. Let's continue on here. We have father of sticks, upright. Ace of baskets in reverse. Eight of sticks in reverse. Mother didn't care nothing about no love. <laughs> okay. She did not care if you love her or not. You cannot wield your stick at my child here. Thinking that, um, you know. You can have her or that will allow you in her space, in our space, in our home. Remove your energy. Remove yourself from our home. This is our daughter, not yours. Well, that came to an end, but it didn't come to an end, I feel, in the way um, maybe the mother who didn't want this would have liked. I feel as though um, there was something here that she could not, it's like get rid of, undo. I feel as though the mother here, this young girl's mother, um, Almost like maybe she played the role of mother and father in in terms that of um, her mate having the final say, okay, of what went on in the home with her daughter. Six of sticks in reverse. The big queen upright. Fellow jack in reverse. 
quite obviously there was no victory here okay this came to an end this relationship ended This young girl uh, might have felt like she was, was pregnant or got pregnant by the man, gave birth. Maybe this is the what happened here that the girl's mother could not undo the deed. I'm hearing dastardly, but yet the deed has been done. The man was removed. No longer a target. No longer a targeted um, individual. We will leave you be if you allow us. Hmm, that's interesting. I'm hearing if you allow us to leave you be, we will leave you. We won't hurt you. We'll let you go. I wonder if the man was, or if the girl was underage. I'm hearing, oh, hold on. Okay, the, the young man was older. The man was older, younger. She was too young to allow this to take place. But I feel as though there was someone else here. Maybe some kind of patriarch watching. A patriarch to uh, the man. Watching him. What he was doing, what he was up to, where he was going. Spending his time with this young uh, girl. Let me see if anything comes out that I can work with. I just wonder, how did they meet? Well, got the ace of sticks right there, so speaks to that sexual energy. But I do feel as though there was excitement here. Oh, I'm hearing he excited her. Okay. But in his excitement... There was a home here, so this man might have been married. He was. Okay, he had someone, he had a wife, a home that he built. Oh, what's in the midst of building? How did they meet? Hmm. Maybe this um, home that he had. Maybe it was coming to an end. I wonder, was it coming to an end um, as a result of this or before this? I'm hearing before. The marriage was complete. It had ended. But they moved on. Okay. They continued on to make a home despite the situation.
feel like this mother of sticks is the wife to uh, this patriarch here. They were both aware of what was happening. I feel not just the this patriarchal figure, but um, I feel like this was his wife. This mother sticks upright, knowing what uh, the young man was doing. I'm hearing the father, okay? Uh, he, the husband had a home, got this girl pregnant here, and brought forth seed, his seed, with the young woman. It was a girl. All right, anything else? I'm trying to figure out how they met, but anything else? Hmm. Well. Like I said, a prof uh, 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 a seed, a child, okay, with this young girl here. Hmm. Manifested this baby girl. That I feel as though with it in the reverse, I feel like I feel like this child was unwanted or hated. Didn't want to be reminded, okay, of the soul or something like that brought forth through this union of denial. Okay. But he could not have. Felt like maybe he felt stuck, that he couldn't have this young girl. He had to stay with this home that he created. Didn't have to. Chose to. Maybe he did have to. I don't know. But maybe he felt stuck in some way, shape, or form that he had to go back. Okay. And I feel as though maybe he felt he felt like there were no options here. Like I don't have a choice. Anything else? I'm not really getting what I want in terms of how they met. Anything else? Hmm. Nothing is coming out. Maybe not. I'll give it one more shuffle. And if nothing else, that's it. This speaks to possibly how they met, which is what I've been trying to find out. Let me see. Just here and they carried on and they proceeded forward. Fake home. There was no love in this home. But wanted to give the appearance that all was well.
I'm hearing that's it. Thank you.